Good morning everyone! Our lesson for today is about other kind of food borne diseases. It is the continuation of our lesson last session. So let's start from number 5. It is called Hepatitis A. Hepatitis A, these diseases include also the symptoms of diarrhea and one of its most distinguishing symptoms is dentist, characterized by the yellowing of the skin and white part of our eyes. A Hepatitis A virus or what we call HAV can enter the body through food or drink contaminated by the passes of someone with virus. And number six, cholera. Cholera, this disease caused by the bacterium Vibrio cholerae. Food can contaminate it due to poor handling and unsanitary conditions, while water can be contaminated due to exposure to fecal matter. Symptoms of cholera include watery diarrhea that lasts a few days, vomiting and muscle cramps. The diarrhea can be so bad that dehydration and loss of electrolytes may occur. The symptoms may start two hours to five days after exposure to the bacterium. Number seven is food poisoning. Food poisoning common causes is food that is left standing for a long period before it is eaten. Organisms like Salmonella, Listeria, E. coli, Shigella, and Campylobacter can cause unsanitary handling. Common symptoms are vomiting, fever, and body aches. The last one is what we call typhoid fever. It is caused by drinking water or eating food contaminated by the bacterium Salmonella typhi from the passes of a contaminated person. It is spread through for sanitation and for hygiene. Symptoms include high fever, abdominal pain, weakness, constipation, headaches, and rashes. And that's the end of our lessons for today. Thank you for listening and keep safe.